what's the what's the play here? Uh, I'm gonna tell you about ran on your parade. That's what I'm gonna do. Wow, tell me more about ran on my parade. It's on your it's parade. On your parade. <laughs> tell me more about rain on your parade i will you know i thought about we probably could just use like parsec the other day instead of yeah, you know. yeah. anyways i'll give you a second to catch up on stream i don't know how far behind it is but um yeah you're raining on the black people right now. yep oh let me rephrase <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit, I accidentally changed it to not Eng oh no. Uh not Portuguese oh, English. There we go. <laughs> there we go. But anyways, you can see I've got a little frog hat. That's the frog I'm talking about. Um that I've had to help occasionally. Let me see. Yeah, I need to find him. No, there's some of these stages that he's in. Did I not do this stage? Anyways, you've all these are stage based. This is a dog. Can you rain on the dog? <gasps> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, you, oh, they're little hands. You're petting a doggy. <laughs> that makes me very uncomfortable. What? The hands? Yeah, like, where the fuck are they? Are they just a man? Torn off hands? There was one where you, like, rain bread. That's cute. I like that. But anyways, this game's pretty silly. Um, it's got a lot of different like stage variety. You're not ever doing the same thing. Like this one was a uh, you have the ability to snow, and so this dude's trying to clear off his snowway, uh, or excuse me, his driveway, not his snowway. And so your goal is to just fill it up with snow <laughs> until he gives up. And that's it. Like that's your entire goal for this stage is just to fill up his driveway. Just, what, just to fuck with so this dude. Weird. Well, there's also a stage where um, there's a weatherman walking to work and your goal is to rain on him his entire walk to work. Aww. Yeah, he's pretty sad. But then like, let me see. Is there where's the Yeah, this one. It came from the sky. <laughs> So this is like a, a, what? Go ahead. Oh. Uh, don't worry, it's, it's a silly bit. I'm more invested in this grayscale, black and white <laughs> depression simulator. Yeah, it's supposed to be like the you know it came from underground because you're uh, you're amassing a zombie horde. And you go through. Wait, what? Yeah. See, you got zombies. And the zombies go around and they'll eat people and turn them into more zombies and the zombies will follow them around. This is fucked. Yeah, isn't it? That's just one oh, yeah, yeah, that's just one stage. That one's actually pretty long, but that one again has its own completely unique mechanic. That just looks like breakout. I haven't got to that yet. Um, this looks like a bathroom. I wanna see if I can't go back real quick and find one of the stages that happens to uh, feature the frog. Let me see here. I don't think it's that one. That one's just you learning how to use. This one was literally, I was like, what am I supposed to do here? And then it's like, just paint. That's my painting. That's what I did before. Ooh, what a beautiful I know, pair. I appreciate that. I see. And I like his underwear. Yeah, I see you like my little pair. I'm glad he's, I'm glad you know what it was. Um. <laughs> Let me see here. And like this one, you're literally just fucking up a restaurant. And just like, let me see. That one, this is referential to Dreamhack. And you're going around and fucking up Dreamhack. Let me see here. Dream quest. Yeah, Cloudy Hill. Oh, I just realized, is this supposed to be Silent Hill? Oh yeah, this one you go around and you just like scare people. Like you just straight up like are in a dark building. There's a lot of references in this. Like look at this fucking shit. You're just going around. Oh, this is definitely silent. Yeah, like you're scaring. You know. So you're meant to scare the shit out of these uh, people. And if they catch you, you actually do get caught. And they're all pissed off. And then that essentially ends your, your run. But, uh, and like I said, there's like a Metal Gear stage. There's, yeah, this stage, The Office, is literally you playing through like five state, like five episodes of The Office. <laughs> Ding. 
Yeah. And this can't be the office. There's more than two brown. <laughs> The cloud. And so, I mean, they'll give you your, you know, your objective to go soak everybody in this case, and I think, like, the next one is, like, you fill up everybody's uh, coffee mugs with coffee. Um, it's a silly, silly group. Let me think. They won't let me go over there yet. Did I get everybody already? No. Nope. There we go. No, it's going down. I'm running out of pee. In episode two, you can go on, you get coffee over here, and then you would fill up everybody's coffee mugs with coffee. And then it just kind of continues from there. But I just thought it was interesting how they kind of recreated the office in some small way. I think this... Ah, uh, the office office. The going to work, I think, is the Weatherman one I was talking about, where you... Yeah, you don't stop running on him his entire way. And it's like sad and depressing. And so you can kind of see the variety of like different gameplay elements that they've used with these very simple um, control schemes. Like I said, this one is the, the one where you rain bread. And that causes birds to come to fight. <laughs> Let's start trying to get the red. <laughs> and I'll just keep screwing everything up and pooping on people's heads. And I'll just keep coming. As long as I'm holding down the button. And... Oh, you knocked out the hot dogs there! Uh, yeah. That's part of, I think that's part of my goal is to knock stuff over. I still have somebody I haven't pooped on yet. Good job. And yeah, so any of the objectives in the upper left that have like stars next to them are required to finish the stage, but you are not necessarily required in a general sense to do all of them. Is the froggy? Oh, here's your frog friend. Cloudy, cloudy, help! I'll wait for you to catch up in a second. Cloudy, cloudy, help! <laughs> this is the pond where I grew up, the pond where I had my first crush and bought my first Nintendo Switch. <laughs> and now these humans are invading our lands with their tents and fires. Do you even know how flammable trees are? I had to hide my wife, hide my kids, Ribbit. <laughs> Not referential. Please scare them off, Cloudy. You're our only hope, Ribbit. And so same idea. It gives you some objectives of stuff to do. Put out the fire. Light their tents on fire. Which can in turn what? light the forest on fire. <laughs> Oh, like that? Yeah. I didn't mean for that to happen. Because I can put out the fire from the tent before it starts to catch the forest on fire, but... Oh, well. Um... Mm, unfortunate. Yeah, let me... Let me... Why did I finish that scene? Let me... Let me see real quick. Cloud Buster... Cloud Buster... I'm trying to see here. I'm trying to find the, uh... Warehouse. No, that's not it. Birthday party, you literally go and like fuck up a kid's birthday by burning all his presents. Card. Burning? Yeah. Uh, cardboard gear cloud. I wonder what that is. Might be uh, Final Fantasy VII. Because mm -hmm. it has a cloud. <laughs> <laughs> you have the little bandana. <laughs> <laughs> so. That's so cute. Yeah, it's. And that's what, like, as soon as I saw this, I was like, okay, I thought this was just a silly game, but this is actually pretty fucking funny. And so, you will actually fail if they uh, manage to see you. Like, just like that guy's chasing me now. And my objective is to get to the middle cloud. And the dude will randomly talk to you, I think, but maybe not while I'm being chased. There you go. <laughs> so anyways and then yeah you just get to the end and blow up that uh that cannon there or whatever did you ever watch cannon busters nope. it's fucking garbage ah yeah yeah don't do it you 
crazy seminal star star stuff. Yeah, it, it bleeps it out. But, um, yeah, it's a pretty, pretty interesting game, the fact that they do all these little referential things. Um, and like I was saying, let me see if I can't find the, uh, there's the one that, it's like really early on, too. Yeah, the dust, given that that's the Counter-Strike stage, the dust. And your objective is literally to protect this bomb. And that way it can explode. Did they shoot at you? Nope. I'm pretty much done. Oh, wait. Yeah, there we go. Because I don't think they can do anything once they've slipped. Like, I don't think they can disarm the bomb. Because at this point, you'd only be able to rain. You haven't unlocked the snow power yet. But, you're not going to be able to stop it. Wait, so does that mean that you're the terrorist? Um, that's a good point. I guess I am. <laughs> the cloud does not seem to be, like, it's definitely a chaotic, chaotic neutral sort, or potentially even chaotic neutral. The cloud does not seem to be to the benefit of society. What do you give me? You can. It's true. But anyways, yeah, that was the first one. I was like, this is just, fuck, this is just Counter-Strike. Okay. And I think that's really kind of what kept me going. Like, you can unlock hats for having, like, starred a lot of these, um, these places. So, oh, I didn't even realize there's, like, a little arcade machine. That wasn't there before. Now sheep. I guess the more stuff you finish, they fill up your house with the different levels that you completed. Oh, it says you can play the arcade? Yeah, I need to check that. But anyways, you get different hats. And so... Oh, the sheep fucked up the arcade! Yeah, I saw that. Let's do Master of Art. Santa hat. Well, Pick up your stuff, Todd. You, that you fucked up. That is a straight up reference to Bojack. Uh, Doge. You can't, you can't show me the frog hat and be like, yeah, there's other hats. You gotta, you gotta build up to the frog hat. You should have removed the frog You're hat. Right. You're right. I, I should have. That's my bad. <laughs> and this little pigeon hat. Pigeon's pretty cute. Sheep hat. Well, uh, the chicken hat, I definitely like that. I feel like the chicken hat is referential to um, an anime called Scissor 7, which is like a little tiny chicken that looks very similar to this. And of course the bandana and some other less interesting stuff. It also looks like uh, Rob Lucci's pigeon. The, the pigeon itself, or the, the chicken? The chicken. The brown yeah, chicken? Yeah, Rob Lucci. Yeah. yeah. Sure, yeah. Probably should watch the other seven and see that. But anyways, obviously you get all these little accessories as well. I just got the crowbar right now. You can change your colors. So you could be a you can be a green cloud with the green froggy. But this is what I'm at at this point. Yeah, I want to see what's up with the uh, the play. I wasn't even aware of this thing. Soak all humans, destroy 15 data towers, defeat the boss. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this? Yeah. It's fucking, it's fucking doom. Alright, cool. Uh, soak all the humans and... Yeah, this game is pretty wild. This game is pretty wild. Can I change weapons? Oh, I've got my snow stuff too. Key. Yeah, it's even got like doom-like music. <laughs> How do I change my weapons? It's got the little face in the bottom. Oh, uh oh. Is that the boss? The sun? <laughs> this sounds like, yeah, mate, there! <laughs> Shit. Okay, I've got some keys to open some doors. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Ooh, speedrunner? Oh, oh. <laughs> he's dead. <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. Yeah, these guys aren't really doing a whole lot.
Oh, is that the- oh, oh fuck. <laughs> okay. They're pretty much just cackling. Oh, no. Oh. oh, fuck. I'm out of bullets. I don't think I have one. Oh wait, I do have thunder. I want a thunder. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Is that your melee? The thunder, maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> oh, <that's> a... oh shit! <laughs> yeah, you see now. Bro, how do you not take damage? That's a good question. I've not taken any damage this far. I can't imagine they programmed it to, to be incredibly, uh, let's see what I'm thinking of. Difficult? Rep yeah, like, a, it's probably not super representative that they really care if you actually take damage or not. What am I looking at? Destroy all 15 data towers. Oh, am I dumb? I'm sorry. Oh, fuck. I took damage. What hit? Oh, there you go. Yeah. Did it. Adi. Is this the data tower? Oh, that is the data tower. Okay. Oh. Oh, that okay. But yeah, I mean, honestly, I don't think there's much else to show of this that wouldn't uh, be just like kind of ruining the rest of the surprises. And I'm sure there's more references and different stuff like that further into the game that I still have not reached. I think I'll probably end up finishing this for sure. Uh, just given there's a lot of wacky stuff in here I really wasn't expecting for there to be. Um, there may be even references to stuff that we've already gone through that I just completely didn't realize was a reference. Let me see. That many. And that, and that. And that. That one. Those two. Okay, so that's all the data centers. Got a couple more Hoomans. And. Like that one. And then that was the boss, which appears to be. That's cute. I didn't even realize it's got my like my painting in the on the wall when I get back to my house. And then you can uh, you can actually draw your own face if you wanted to. So <laughs> that was the one I drew. I can imagine this could be pretty bad. <laughs> There's no frogs covering your eyes. But even though you'd be drawing your own face, I think it kind of like it's not gonna emote or anything like that. So it like takes away from. Like, I just rather have the base face because the base face has its cute little emotes. Let's see. It's got a mustache. It's Dad Cloud. Hey kids. Want me to pee on you? Uh, that's not Dad Cloud. <laughs> that's, uh... That's, uh, your dad's friend that your parents don't leave you alone with, Cloud. Oh. What's his name? You know which one I'm talking about. <laughs> Steve. He does seem like a Steve. Yeah, he seems like a Steve. But yeah, Steve Buskin. let me see, let me, let me get a new stage in here, let's try this breakout one. It's my weird dad face. Don't lose the ball. What the fuck? I don't do this. Oh. Just block the entryway so that way I can't 
can't get out. Is that what they want you to do? Does it break the snow? <laughs> <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> I'm definitely losing him, but it's worth it. Get the cloud out ball moving over 200 miles per hour. And apparently that's intended, as there's an achievement that's related to that. Right. But yeah, so... Bro, it's hit maximum overdrive? <laughs> So given I didn't get all of them, I now have- oh shit. Okay. My goal- No, I think you just have to complete all of them in general. Why are they going so fast? <laughs> oh, I can kill my own snow. I didn't realize that. Okay. Well, it shouldn't- Well, what the fuck? I figured in theory it wouldn't go through if there was snow in the way. No, the snow's freezing <laughs> Oh. Okay. Because I just saw that shit teleport. Is it gonna, snow. like, does it bounce off of me? Because, like, it's not going in if I stay down here, I feel like. You said you have lightning. Yeah, that's what I'm using to like, get its initial boost to speed. But I'm like... Fuck. Kind of like I am. Let me see here. But I like don't know how I'm supposed to like not get him immediately to fall into the hole. Why the fuck? I feel like I was doing fairly well last time. Just rain on him. Oh, it literally has like a meters per second in the bottom right. I didn't realize that. That's a good one. Yeah, I'm trying to slow it down. Oh, okay. See, I thought it went through there. Boink, boink. Oh, this should be okay. Being careful enough of that. Ginger barking. Oh, Ginger. I know. No! <laughs> uh, <shit. laughs> That's what you get for being impatient. But uh, it was moving so slow. When it gets close to me, like the cloud was lighting up, so that's where I was like getting confused. Good God! I don't want to think I'm happy. Yeah. After this. Fuck. Yeah. Dude, that snow is not a good idea. <laughs> I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. It's so boring. I think you gotta take it real slow. I'm trying. I'm trying to take it one day at a time. I'm just kidding. I'm so stupid. You must really like them. You must really like laying on your parade. But it's fucking moving so slow. Like I have to do when, something. When the thing, but it, look what it did. Alright, maybe shoot a little. Cat's gonna have a little. <laughs> what the fuck? No, please don't go in there. Please don't go in there. Come on. There's like no determination as to like. There's no control over this. Can you, like, control your height? No. No, I cannot. There's no height control. Fucking... Mm. Okay. 
This is probably one of the harder ones I've had to do to get our objectives done, honestly. Most of them are pretty much done in like one or two goes. There we go. There we go. Okay. Yeah. No kidding. I'm just not gonna, I'm not gonna lighten it. I'm just gonna let it do its thing. This is the closest we've been. It seems to be taking care of itself. I was thinking about, um, I wanted to play that One Piece Pirate Warriors game. Uh, yeah, the, the Muso one. You know what that means? Because yeah. I have it on Steam, but once again, it's something I just have not had a chance to play. Those games have a co-op, don't they? Hmm? I think there's like some between shit. I'm sorry, I'm starting to slow my words. I'm gonna get that now. Okay. Okay, yeah, as soon as I'm done with this stage, we can fucking. We can keep it going. No, most of these don't last that long, anyway, so this is, this is a perfect one. I, I think you can get the gist of what this is this far. You say as the ball keeps sliding. <laughs> back, it's the wall, it's seven miles. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't want to fuck it up, but it's so close. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think I've got it. There we go. I don't want to, I don't want to hit it, because I'm like, I'm afraid it's going to just bounce right into the fucking hole with these two left. Ooh. Yeah, and trying to be as far away from it as possible. Oh, that's been that. I think I think this should do it. I'm prepared for it to just randomly bounce off the wall and go straight into the hole. I like four yeah. people here. <laughs> <laughs> per hour, just lights. Right. <laughs> oh fuck. Okay. I got one. <laughs> Okay, I don't want to speed it up more, but I've got to get it off this wall. Here's the problem. Okay, I think that'll do it. Hey! Boom! Okay. So I just got a Space Invaders hat for that. Wonderful. What's up with this bathroom? Oh yeah, I forgot. You'd like this character as well. You should see it here in a second. <laughs> a little, little granny with the, the chicken on her head. I know there, little cow. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like someone left quite the stink. Did you know there are communities of people who love watching things being clean? Suppose it's oddly satisfying to watch a very dirty surface systematically get cleaned. Anyway, would you be a deer and clean this mess with your power shower? <laughs> Thanks, sweetie. Will you watch the doom on my phone? <laughs> yeah, and then once again, this is like a completely different mechanic from anything else I've seen this far. This cloud really is chaotic. Right? Yeah. Ginger's also chaotic. Yeah, she's all over the place. But to no one else, this gain or her own gain. Just the general. I kind of like it. Yeah. And when it's not next to you, I couldn't stand that shit. Okay. Oh, right. And I guess like, I'll let you see this. So essentially the whole game like starts by this grandpa telling his grandson um, about this cloud as like a bedtime story. And so I guess that's like the, the whole purpose for all of this. It's so cloudy, it's tired, it was tired, it was time to head back home. The end. What? Just kidding. 
You don't think Cloudy would give up that easily. Hmm? I don't know. You know, when your mom remarried, I told her how proud I how proud I am she didn't give up. And gave someone new another chance. Hmm? I know, I know. But you need to be brave like her and never give up. Thank you, Ginger. Just like Cloudy would. Alright. So what did Cloudy do next? Well, as a matter of fact, Cloudy was just about to become a very famous TV star. Oh, <laughs> yeah, they're really happy for Cloudy yeah. to hear that. <laughs> oh, Weather Dan. Roll up the Weatherman down the stairwell, point camera, green screen, do a weather report. But anywho, I think that kind of gives the, the gist of what this game is about. Oh. Thank you for the insightful uh, input there, Gish. I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear it. That's the worst part. I can hear her go. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, thanks, Gish. You have any questions? I think you're good, probably. Um, does the cloud fuck? I, I'll let you know if there's a stage in which the cloud gets a donger and fucks. Does that sound fair? Thanks, Gish. I'm going to take a nap. Sounds like a plan.